Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sierra, and today I am doing a collab with the mix Lexi Bell. She is amazing. I love her. She's so funny, and oh, I love her. Um, we did a tiny home challenge, I guess you could say. Um, we... I, always, I went on her channel, she does tiny homes, and I was like, alright, that answers that, that's what we're gonna do. And then, we switched it up, and we picked, like, themes for each other. So, she chose, like, a modern farmhouse type, and she sent me a reference picture, and that's actually what I did, like, on the outside, so... Yeah, I'll make sure to show that, but, um, and then for her, I chose, I can't remember what I called it, I'm looking, I did, oh, Coastal Cottage, so it's funny we both chose cottage stuff, but when you think of small homes, you think of cottages, right? So, yeah, I did a tiny home, like an actual tiny home lot, I don't know if she will, but I did because I spent money on this pack and I was like, I don't use this feature, so I'm going to use it. So, it's a one bedroom, one bath, one living, one dining, one everything house. It's very small. I had a hard time with it. Like, a very hard time with it. And I had to keep going on to Pinterest so I could find reference pictures. So, my Pinterest search history is a disaster. It's like... Rustic farmhouse modern living. So, a lot of the house is based off stuff I found on Pinterest. So, thanks Pinterest. Um, but yeah, this was fun. I don't really do modern. I have a hard time with modern, just plain modern, because I like to like cozy. And then when she was like, no, 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 rustic, I was like, all right, I've never done rustic modern, I don't think. So it was really fun, and I want to say thank you to Lexi for collabing with me, and guess what? She's also a March baby, so make sure on her video to go tell her happy birthday, because, duh, um, but yeah, it's funny, I filmed this video on Super Bowl Sunday, and so like, I'll forever think of this build as like my Super Bowl build. I don't know if you guys do that, but if I'm building something and I'm like listening to a song or watching a show or something with it, I associate that with it. I think I've talked about this before. Like one build I associate with my wisdom teeth because while I was building it, I got the call about when I'm getting my wisdom teeth out. And like there's another build that I did that I associate with the song Freak by Doja Cat because I listened to that song on repeat while I was building. I don't know. I don't know if people are like that, but that's what I do. Not that you guys wouldn't know, but anyways, more about back to the house. So, I played around with modern, like keeping it very neutral color tones and very minimal. But I also played around with lots of wood, so you can see there's like light wood and dark wood. Which I like. I think it complements each other very nice. I feel like wood, like you, you can't go wrong with it. And I like can't decide if I like the different color counters. It's like, sometimes I'm like, yes, and other times I'm like, ew. So I don't know, you should let me know what you think about that. Um, but yeah, a lot of the rooms I did get inspiration off of Pinterest for, so that's why they're done a certain way. But, like, the decor and stuff is pretty much all me, but, like, layouts, I guess, and colorings are Pinterest. Um, I wanted to make a sectional so bad, but I couldn't pull it off. I want a sectional so bad. And like pillows. Oh, Sam's, come on, EA. Um, and I was having a hard time picking what the accent color was going to be because I like to play around with an accent color. And I couldn't decide between blue and yellow, and I think I ended up with yellow, which is cute. In my opinion. And then I tried to do fun stuff, but it didn't work out, which sucks, but that's alright. It's 
still cute. In the end, it takes a minute though. Like, there was a few times where I was like, I'm just gonna scrap this whole boot. It's so ugly. But I pulled it off. So, hmm. I call it that a success. I did think about adding like a dog or a cat like food and stuff for them but I did it and I kind of wish I did now next time next time next time um if you are interested in this build and want to download it it is up on the gallery my information's in the description and I'm sure Lexi's is up on the gallery as well if you want to download it but yeah those windows those pointy windows are so cool I've never used them and I was like heck yeah I don't know if they're I don't know if they fit the theme, but I don't care. Because they're cute. Um, but yeah, I picked such a weird layout. But it's hard when you have tiny homes. Because it's like, like this is 100 squares, I believe. So it's like, I did what I could do. And I think I killed it. Um, yeah, and those shells, oh my gosh. We need more stuff to decor decorate shelves just saying like <sighs> so many things um i don't know what else to talk about i hate like voiceovers are fun but then it's like you get to a point and you're like look at that couch you know oh i love those couches and the rugs oh my gosh i love what i did with the rugs the two different rugs <laughs> and baby yoda Look at him. He's so cute. I have a Baby Yoda doll. Fun fact, I got him for Christmas. Sorry, Grogu. And he sits on my bed and watches me sleep. It's very adorable. Except his head slams against the wall sometimes and I'm like, eh, what? Um, I left the bedroom for last because I couldn't figure out what I wanted to do. I saw this inspiration picture and I was like, oh, that's so cute. But I couldn't pull it off. I wish we had like metal framed beds. You know what I'm talking about? Those really cute little metal frame beds. Oh, I would die. I've, there's been so, oh, there's been so many builds where I'm like, can we please have that in the game? That's all I want. And then we don't get it. And I'm like, cool. But maybe one day. Maybe one day. So, yeah, the bedroom, you can see I played a lot with the wood tones. I think the kitchen. No, I played with the wood tones a lot throughout this house. So, yeah. I don't, so I don't know if this is technically considered modern. Uh, what'd she say? I, oh my gosh, I'm horrible. I don't remember what she called it. Oh my goodness, I have to look it up. I'm, I'm, I'm a modern, modern, modern farmhouse. But I did look it up and it was like, pins from like HGTV and Wayfair and things like that so I feel like I can trust them. I hope. Um, yeah, I loved the plants. I feel like I could have put more plants in but I didn't but that's alright. It's still very cute. Um, and then obviously I went with white black on the outside so cool and i love oh my gosh right here what i did oh you're gonna die look at that the scattered like prick oh looks so cute my brain it does wonder sometimes sometimes it doesn't work most of the time it doesn't work but sometimes it does stuff like that and i'm like yes um i was you'll see in a minute I tried building a backyard, but I just wasn't feeling it. Nothing was working out to my liking, which was making me mad. Cause I was like, <laughs> I mean, I just want a hot tub and a little barbecue, but it's not working. So there is no backyard. I'm sorry. And the lot, it's on a way bigger lot than it actually needs to be. Unless you want to add a backyard, if you download it, then go for it. But, see, here's my failed backyard attempt. I was gonna delete it, but then I was like, nah. I gotta keep it in, so it's kind of bad. So, we all gotta laugh at it. It's just, I don't know. It's just hard. I have a hard time with backyards. Because I'm like, pool? 
barbecue and then what else you know like grass like you can't really do much in a backyard unless you want to do terraforming and girl terraforming stresses me out so and i don't know why i picked strangerville for this build literally no idea i was just like hmm, where am i gonna build this oh strangerville i feel like oasis springs would have been a much better place for this build but no i did the strangerville i don't know i don't know well i'm gonna end the voice over here i hope you enjoyed this video make sure again to go watch lexi's video subscribe to her channel like and comment on all of her videos all right she's amazing and follow her everywhere she has links to and yeah and wish her a happy birthday all right um, thank you, Lexi, for collabing with me. This was so fun, and we should collab again, okay? Um, yeah, so, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, make sure to give my video a like and a comment, and subscribe to me, and I will see 